Our second speaker from last year's competition, CEO of Aurora Biofuels, proves that winning isn't the only thing. His team was a hair's breadth from winning the transportation category and has become very successful in its early stages. It's my pleasure to introduce Matt Kaspari. Thank you. So we participated last year in the competition and really had a great time at the event and found it extremely helpful for our company. So we're, we're very honored to be invited back uh, by the sponsors of the competition, tell you a little bit about us and help with this, this launch event for this great competition. Uh, so Aurora, a couple of years ago, saw this great product out on the market called Biodiesel. I'm sure a lot of people in the audience are familiar with. It's an environmentally friendly product. Uh, it can be produced here in the U.S., so it lessens our dependence on foreign sources of fuel. You can distribute this product with existing infrastructure so you can get it to market today. The problem we saw is that there wasn't a whole lot of this biodiesel available. So as we began investigating the market, we saw that really the issue with biodiesel was what's the input? Where does the feedstock come from? And today in the U.S., the vast majority of biodiesel comes from soy. So that's an agricultural crop that's grown for, for food sources. Um, and the problem with it is it's really not a scalable solution to creating a fuel product. If you take a lot of soy and divert it for fuel uses, it's not available there for food. That causes major trickle-down effects in, in food markets. So we put together a team with really diverse backgrounds coming from um, the healthcare industry, biotechnology, uh, traditional petrochemical engineering. And we looked at what are different types of feedstocks that you could use for biofuel production. And the most promising source that we saw was actually algae. Um, algae are interesting uh, organisms. They're photosynthetic. They grow extremely quickly, and they can contain um, high quantities of oil. So we looked at algae as a way to address this problem uh, on the feedstock side and started working towards putting together a concept, an idea, a vision, a plan of how do you actually commercialize this, uh, make this viable. We came across this, this competition, uh, statewide California competition, uh, focused that cl on clean tech. Uh, looked like a great opportunity for us to get out there, um, get some feedback on our plan, and, and really see um, how the company stood up against what else was, was being developed. So we entered the clean tech open. Uh, we're able to get our ideas really down on paper, um, get in front of potential investors, and get really clear feedback on the vision that we had for the company. I suggest to, to any potential entrepreneurs out there that this is a great way, uh, really low risk, no risk way to get out there and, and see what the reaction is uh, to your plan. To us, I think it was extremely helpful in helping us shape really the, the milestones for the company, see what issues people raised for the, the plan, help us refine that before we went out into the real world uh, looking for, for a Series A round of funding. So what we're happy to announce, uh, since we participated in this competition late last year, we did go out to the kind of traditional venture capital market uh, with our ideas, um, honed from this competition, improved, and we're able to raise a $5 million Series A investment from three local venture capital firms. <laughs> Thank you. So that's been uh, extremely exciting for us to, to see this idea that was really on paper last year. And just in several months, uh, we've opened up a laboratory, an office, hired an amazing team of scientists and engineers, uh, really started executing on the vision that we had, uh, made a ton of progress, and that we're extremely thankful to this, this competition for getting us out there. I think that the visibility that you gain from this type of event uh, is extremely helpful in, in getting a company off of the ground. Uh, we're strong supporters of this. Uh, very happy to be here and to see this competition take place in uh, 2007. I think it's going to be a, a great event for all the potential investors in the room. Uh, we think there's going to be some great companies coming out this year. So thank you very much for inviting us. Uh, enjoy the competition. <laughs> 